Hello my virtual friends, my name is Catherine, also known as Miss Blue, and welcome to Tsunami Cruiser. This is a wavy navy shoot em up game where we have to help our boats survive as long as possible and destroy all the enemies. That's all I know of it. So, let's get in and rule the waves. Start game. Right. I guess, can we move? Oh, we can, okay. A, B to move, mouse A. Oh gosh, yeah. As you can probably tell, this game is an explosion of color and fireworks and it's crazy and awesome at the same time. And we have four lives, apparently. We can't jump, though. Which, of course, is a obvious, because boats can't jump. In case you couldn't tell, boats can't jump. But anyway, right. Uh, we just have to take care of all the fish that are just coming after, I don't know, where to come and eat us. And explode them into awesome-looking fireworks. That's what immediately caught my eye for this game, was the crazy effects that it had going. We cleared level one, now we got level two with fire planes. All right, then I'll let's have a big old no on that with your minds, Mr. Plane. Get those out of here. Don't be wanting any of that. I keep pressing W thinking I can jump. I'm like, no, I need to jump. Get away from the mines, get away from the mines. This reminds me of uh, Wibble Wobble, that game I played forever ago now. It's a great little game because of the ever-changing uh, landscapes that we're on currently. Sorry for that, there's actually no resemblance, but... The mines, though, they're kind of similar at least, but still. We are making our way through, and is that level two done? Or do you want the mine gone first? Hold on, there we go. Yeah, level two. Or right, now we're on level three. Also, something else was over there, but I accidentally murdered it before you could get a chance to come and murder me. I can only imagine what good things are going on over there. Take it off. Oh, I saw you, jellyfish. No, 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 no. Stay away with your nonsense. All right, I think that's pretty much, ah, God. I looked up for one second. Oh good, we're still on this level though, great. Excellent. If you hear any noise, like while I was looking up as the window cleaner just survived, so if you hear any noises, that's what that is. <laughs> Either way, so, how are we all doing? Hope you're doing well, first shift today. Oh boy. I'm both greatly looking forward to it and so not at the same time because I have so much fucking work to do this week, you have no idea. There's a lot of things going on in the household, but oh! Another shit! Fire at will! Get it away, get it away! Get it away faster! I'm, gl I'm so glad. I was gonna say I'm so glad my shots go through the water, but then they fucking don't. <laughs> Never mind then. Oh god, game, calm down, calm down. Extra life! Hell yes. This could literally go on forever now since I'm doing so damn well at it. As you can all definitely tell. So far. Nah, it's all right, I'm not panicking at all. This is easy, easy, easy game. There we go, level four. No idea how many levels there are, but there are certainly a good few by the looks of it. I just checked because it's going forever. Oh yeah, that's what I did say, it's an endless type deal. So, we're pretty much gonna go till we're dead, which may not even be soon at this point, looking at all this madness, but there could be new things to be additioned soon enough. That guy got a little too close there. I was focused on the jellyfish because he was coming up right next to us, but I got him, so it's okay. It's all good. Oh, dang it. I got him, meaning I got the boat, but then didn't pay attention to the jellyfish. Can't keep an eye out on everything, apparently, unless you're skilled enough for it, which I apparently am not, so. Goody, 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 goody. Damn it. Oh, I can't be this bad at it. Come on. All right, we've got two lives left. That's fine. Just kind of let everything get in the way, that's all. Yeah, focus. Don't go crazy. Aside from uh, job prospects and the fun of doing that. No! Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, it was just, yeah, it was just work. Oh, what is that? Evil starfish of evil must be destroyed before it gets near me. Oh, it's exploding the little ones that come straight for me. Okay, then. Fairness unbound. And that fish just dive bombed me and moidered me. Great. Ha. <sighs> Again. Right. Oh, you start off with the starfish this time. Great. Now that I know the hardness of this game, it's going to really throw it at me. All right, that's fine, that's fine. I can deal, let's see a point a little better. I hope the frame rate doesn't die on me. Both equally, uh, equal things, yes. 
Oh yeah, I was gonna talk about Cuphead. Started playing that the other day. And a bit last night. I defeated like three bosses alone last night. I'm so into that game. I love it so much. It's so fun. I love it. But it's diff it can be really difficult, but... It's just like... Uh, it's a simple pattern memorizing game with those bosses, so it's not hugely difficult. And I dare not say it's just like Dark Souls. It's only like Dark Souls in the fact that you feel better about it once you... You get the same sort of feeling, of, or the rush type feeling, when you finally defeat a difficult boss you've been doing for like 20 minutes or 30 minutes or even more. Goodness knows how much more. <laughs> that kind of thing. But then there's nothing else really that's that close to it. I mean, you could say technically, like, you can just go through a chart, actually. It doesn't have a medieval, medieval-esque setting. It's not like Dark Souls. Do you heal with one thing? Can your currency be stolen away from you if you don't collect it back within the first 10 seconds or without dying twice in a row? It ain't like Dark Souls, that's for sure. And Cuphead certainly does not have any of those things. For one thing, for one thing, it's set in, like, the 30s, for one thing. Oh, I just said for the one thing twice, and we're on level 9 for some reason. Oh, well. Ah. <laughs> I thought I could, he would dip and I would get over, but oh well. Never mind, anyway, yeah. Fun old game, totally recommend it. Not doing a let's play on it though, because Jesus Christ. It'll take me 30 damn years to do one video on it. Plus I work better with those kind of games when I'm just like dead silent and focused, so that's why. Plus everyone else is doing one, you've already seen either them do it or you've played the game for yourself, so oh well. Though no, interesting enough, everybody's going on hiatus. It's great and bad at the same time. Let's start at level 9. Oh, okay. Oh. You know what? Yeah, let's start at level 9. Let's just cheat a little here for a minute here, lads. You allow me the opportunity and there are aliens. But of course. Of course there are aliens. But yeah, of course they're all going on for very good reasons. They're going on tour for God's sake, but... I mean, a lot of people are like, oh, what will we do? And I'm like, well, there's a lot of other Let's Players out there, so it's not a huge deal. We won't all, they're not gone forever. This isn't a I'm quitting YouTube type deal. I doubt they resort to that kind of clickbait. Then again, some of them kind of have. Once or twice is for fun, I guess. For some reason, I thought Felix there for some he hasn't done that. I think, oh yeah, he totally did. That I'm going to delete my channel fiasco. That happened, then we all remember. I remember talking about it in one of the videos, and I was like, he's not gonna do it, there's no way. He's not silly enough to delete like seven years of his life just so casually. But then of course, that is exactly true, because he didn't, so. Oh well then, anyway, enough of that. On back to this game. It's so good, I like this a lot. The style's so unique and great. And the AI on the fish. Ah, top notch. Killed me in a second. All right, never mind. We're gonna focus this time. I should get somewhere. Even though we cheated and skipped past a couple levels, we're fine. Despite the alien rain murdering us from above. That's happening. That's also a thing. Try and avoid that from now on. Those zigzag shots of doom and evil. Couldn't even finish saying their name before I was moited by them. Damn it. There's a lot of creativity in the uh, uh, characters in this game, so that's a definitely a good selling point of this game. Frame break why? <laughs> that was my own fault. I waltz into a jellyfish, and it's game over. All right then. So, let's see how far can we go off exactly? How far game? How oh, there's 18 levels. Well, I think we can obviously go to 18, just to see how horrifying the last level is. Gotta see that at least, just to show off all the actual enemies that you probably won't be able to see under my skill level, quote unquote. That's for sure. So then again, that was some sweet dodging. <laughs> I pretty much ran into the fray and then died promptly. Good, good for me. Anyway, yeah, one more shot and then we'll get it over with, i.e. this episode and finish that off before anything else goes down. I doubt we'll be able to finish this one. Unless there is an actual ending to this, but we shall see if I ever get past it. I do not know. That's a big old negatory on that front. Oh well then. Yeah, apparently you can go higher than that. I just didn't, or maybe I didn't make it that far, but I just didn't do it correctly, but. Oh well then. That was Tsunami Cruiser. That was a bloody fun game. I really liked that. Just the, 
unique style and actual gameplay of it all. Don't get seasick. I didn't get seasick, so we're all fine then. So then, let us end that there. Thank you all for kindly for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more, and I hope to see you in the next one. See you later.